Myers High School baseball team is getting closer to a possible repeat with a district title. And as the playoffs grow closer, Fox 4's John Barron tells us how the number 30, how the number 32 state ranked Green Wave look to bring Southwest Florida a state title. When it comes to playoffs, a lot of coaches believe it's Do it. But that's not the case for the Green Wave. All of us working together now, finally for two full seasons, it's obviously you now showing a difference. And the record shows it. At this point in time, Fort Myers High holds the number 32 spot in the state. And that's because we have high expectations for everyone here. The coaching staff holds their team to a pretty high standard. Now the expectations are no longer just, you know, hey, play well. No, we got good ball players here. And it's also at the same time, we expect to make a run for districts every single year. A back-to-back -back district title looks like it could be on the horizon. Last picture. And a large part of that, Esposito, DeMarco, is due to their seniors. Jake will be attending Flagler College. As they look to close out their high school career with another shot at a state title. We work well together and that transforms and transitions down to the players. And uh, now, again, when all of us are working together, we have great chemistry, coaching staff and players, we're all working together. And that's really kind of helped us out. Although these seniors look to lead the diamond with one more victory, coach knows he's got the players to claim that title, but he believes in taking it one game at a time. You just never know in this game. I'd like to say yes, but can't do that. Don't want to jinx myself. Superstition's real in baseball. In Fort Myers, John Barron, Fox 4.